Hello guys, today we make pepperoni kruski. It is a kind of pepper, this small one, red, that we should dry and after we will use for different recipe. So is uh, dry peppers. But this one that I show you is called corno di bue or buffalo horn for the dimension and also for the shape. I have already used this for another recipe. You can find it. You need to roast it on the fire, remove the skin, put it in the jar, and in the winter when you eat them, they are spectacular. Plus, I want to show you other peppers. You never see pepper like this. Very, very big. Only this is uh, 600 grams because inside is very thick. This is typical from my area. Piemonte, here in Carmagnola city, we have also a festival of peppers. In Italy, we have festival for food in every city because for Italian people, the food is sacred. Okay, coming back to our pepperoni kruski. There are small peppers, the skin is not too thick, and usually we dry. How you can dry this one? You need a um, needle, plus a thread. I will use uh, the one, uh, I will use a string for uh, tiny meat. I need to read it because I forgot this word in English. Uh, I will use like a one meter and something because after we need to hang like this, if they are too long, will be too complicated. Better if you do more than one, but not too long, will be easy to move it and so on. Uh, very important, you need to prepare the string. Now if you come close, I'll show you how to do it. Okay, now we need to suit the first one. This big one I will put apart because now we don't need it. Only I want to show you, maybe I will use them to make another recipe very soon. Uh, it's called pasta con pepperoni, panna e birra. So it's pasta with peppers, whipped cream or double cream, plus beer. Very, very spectacular, especially if you are on diet. Somebody will ask why you leave the uh, string so long. This is the trick, because now we will use it to tie the pepper. Now I'll show you when it's tied, we can suit the other peppers. And voila, now need, we need to hang like this here. So we remove the needle. Okay, now we should wait that they dry where we should put them to dry, not directly under the sun, but under the roof like this. Also, if you have a balcony, under the balcony, because still the sun uh, warm up the walls of the house. So the air circulate, sorry for my English, I don't know if it's the uh, right way to explain, and they will dry faster but please don't put under the sun, because if you put under the sun, uh, they become yellowish, and we want to keep this beautiful red color. How long you need to wait until they're ready? I don't know, different country, different weather, different situation. Uh, now we'll check how many grams they are, and next time 
that uh, I go ahead with a video that uh, I show you how they are going. I tell you how many grams they lose in how many days. See you soon. Hello guys, at the end I have to put them under the sun because the winter is coming here in Italy so if you keep uh, far from the sun it will be not enough to dry them uh, so during the day under the sun during the night inside remember like the sun dry tomatoes uh, this one at the beginning was 1176 gram now is 675 gram this one was 1134 grams now is 645 grams so they lost more or less half of their uh, water or they have heaviness sorry for my english so i will keep them like this during the day under the sun and during the night inside and i will let you know when they're ready see you Finally, after two months, they are ready. They are very dry. At the beginning, they were one kilogram and 200 gram. Now they are only 120 grams. You can hear also that they are very dry from the sound. Uh, if where you live, uh, the weather is not perfect, not very dry, maybe there is no uh, enough sun or too much humidity, you can use the oven. You put the peppers in the oven, you uh, on the oven at the maximum temperature of 50 Celsius degree. When the oven reaches the temperature, you turn off the oven. You wait one hour and you do the same again. 50 Celsius degree off the oven and wait. After maybe four or five times, they will be very dry like this. How we use the pepper in Italy? In different recipe. You can use also like a cheese, like we use the cheese on the pasta, on the pizza. For example, now I will fry them. In this way, they become very crunchy. After that you fry them, you remove from the oil. You put uh, in a dish with a kitchen paper. In this way, the oil in excess go in the paper and they are very crunchy because the meaning of the word pepperoni kruski means crunchy peppers and after with the oil that remain in the pot i will cook an egg because this oil will get the taste from the pepper so after the egg will be spectacular um, usually when you buy them they are without the green part that now is brown but i want to keep it because in this way when you fry them the oil cannot go inside how long we should cook them few seconds when the oil reach the temperature of 170 celsius degree you put the peppers in the oil and you count until three or four seconds three is better so one two three and you remove them very easy One, two, three, and four. And now let's cook the egg.
spectacular, especially because they are very crunchy. I'll show you again. Spectacular. The taste is very, very strong of pepper. I don't know how to explain. Okay, guys, remember to subscribe to the channel, to leave me a like, to share this video with your friends. If you try to make it, if in your country there is something similar, please let us know down in the comment. Or you can write me on Instagram, or you can write me the email, or you can find me on Facebook. Bye bye.